Hey guys, Charlie the Plumber here. So I'm going to teach you how to change a flapper assembly or a flush valve assembly on a Mansfield toilet. Uh, this is an old school style Mansfield. You can buy them at one of the big box stores. Uh, basically, this is a three gallon flush flush valve. The one I'm pulling out of here, the black one, is only going to be a 1.6. This is kind of one of the tricks that we've learned. Uh, 1993, 4, 5, somewhere around there, the federal government regulated that all toilets go to 1.6 gallon. In the process of this, a lot of the old buildings are all designed at a quarter inch per foot as far as pitch goes. What's happening is the water is disappearing before the paper is going. So what we're finding is most of the, the drain line plugs that we're getting or that I'm seeing are a paper plug. Well, because the paper is staying behind and the water is going ahead. I call it the old snowball effect where the water will take off and then that, that toilet paper will get bigger and bigger as it rolls down the hill or goes down the drain. So basically this is how I do it. Again, uh, three gallon flush, flush valve, very simple. You can do it really without shutting the water off. Just hold the ball up, pull the hose out. You're gonna have a cap here. This cap unscrews. As you unscrew that cap, you're going to lift the handle up. When you lift the handle up, you gotta get as high as you can and basically this flush valve will come off of it. It's gonna look like this. And this part here is what goes on the handle. So we'll put that off to the side. We'll take the new one. We wanna lift that handle up as far as we get it. There's a guide on here. We're gonna stick that flush valve on and then we'll stick the new flush valve on the handle so it's like that. Once it gets on there like so, we just kind of let that thing go down. We put our cap back on. Tighten her down, just finger tight. We stick her tube back inside there and then we refill it. So now we've went from roughly 1.6 gallons to almost three gallons of flush. It will appear like it's a little bit of a double flush but my theory is it will carry them solids farther downstream where you'll have less uh, paper plugs in the future. So, hey, if you like this handy tip, take a look, uh, give me the thumbs up, comment in the, uh, in the photo or in the uh, boxes below. And uh, it would be awesome if you'd subscribe to the channels. We've got a bunch more videos coming up. And uh, great to see you. Hope to see you here again. Thanks, Charlie the Plumber. See you later.